Hello, we are back with episode 3 of Europa Universal Sport as Norway in our Legacy of the Vikings series. Yeah. In this series, the goal is to own Scotland, Ireland, Brittany, and I'm pretty sure that's the only goals we had set for it. Oh yeah, also, um, Yorkshire. Yeah, that's the only goals that were really set. But he did also say Scandinavian Empire, so Denmark and Sweden. Well, yeah. Um, oh, we can gain 50 mil power, 5,000 manpower, and lose 30 ducats. Gain a star fort, or lose a prestige. Well, let's gain the mil power and the manpower. I like that event a lot. Sadly, Denmark's in our coalition, so no declaring war on them. Um, if one of the coalition members declares war on me, however, that won't be half bad. Did Muscovy set us as a rival? No, okay. Oh! Denmark declared war for coalition. Which is way better than somebody else declaring war for coalition. Um, because Denmark declared war for coalition, Poland and Lithuania get called in. Denmark's only ally, Brunswick, probably didn't even join. Nope. And Pomerania, the other coalition member, joined. So, that's good. Let's wreck, wreck, wreck it, shall we? Um, Sweden's army will probably wreck ours completely and out, outright. So, well, that's a thing. Let's make some trips over here in the mountains. In fact, we should probably get up to the mountains. I don't know. How many trips does Sweden have? Sweden. 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 Sweden has 16,000 trips. They are over their force limit. Well, um, that's encouraging, right? Let's head over to, let's head over to the uh, mountains, and we should have 10,000, um, yep, 10,000 in the mountains hopefully is enough, while we wait for Poland and the Hansa to um, finish up Denmark and Pomerania. Can't we get an insult CV on Sweden, or Scotland loves us? I don't really care if Scotland loves us, but I don't care about a diplomatic insult CV either. So, we get um, improved defenses in what provinces? Which borders do we want more? In Akershus, Edisava, and Bergenschus, so here, or Jamtland, Halogaland, and Lalland. Well, I'd prefer that one because that improves the Swedish core that they're most likely going to try to uh, grab. We have no fort defense man or er, fort defense advisor. Okay. Why don't you stream HD? Well, um there's actually a very simple reason for that. I stream in 720p, which is still HD if you weren't aware. But the reason I don't stream in 1080p is because when I did that last, people complained because I am not a Twitch partner, so I can't, I can't do that. If I streamed in 1080p, um, some people would complain because they wouldn't be able to load the stream, right? Because they can't change the quality because I'm not a Twitch partner. So if Twitch changes their stuff, I will stream in 1080p, but until that day, I won't. We're making a little bit of money. Denmark, sadly, wiped our navy. So let's rebuild that. I think four heavies will be enough. But yeah, I do stream in HD, just not the HD you, you would want. Oh, 
we've lost the siege of Lalan. Okay. Hmm. Sadly. Ooh. Yeah, we're not really going to be able to do much here. Let's move up to Edisava. Or Edisiva. Muscovy has announced this as a rival. Okay. Oh, we are not going to beat them there. Let's stay here then. Oop, and Denmark's going to be helping. Yikes. And Muscovy entered our coalition. Probably because the uh, the relations are so bad from rival and wanting provinces minus 200. Well, that's okay. Let's move back up to uh, Edisava when we can. Or Edisiva. Edisiva. Edisiva, right. I was just reading that wrong for some reason. The name. Edisiva. Is Lithuania just doing nothing? This probably requires a save and reload. Yeah. Probably requires a save and reload. Hmm. Well, nobody's doing anything, so we're going to call that not an episode. <laughs> uh, we'll get back to you in a second. All right, we are back with um, with episode three of the series. Hopefully, Lithuania knows what they're doing. It appears they don't. Uh, this army is moving, at least. Not to anywhere useful, but they're moving. Sadly, right now... Um, their navy is way stronger than ours, so this is going to be a difficult war. Can we just peace out now, actually? We do have a lead. Yeah, we can peace out now. With a concession of defeat. Oh. They require Lolland to be a part of the offer. It's required. Well, we can wait a little bit. For the war score to go up, it's gonna happen, so let's do it. Wow, those Hanseatic trade ships were pretty strong while they lasted. We can grab another mill tech, but let's wait for something to actually happen. Unless that Miltec involves troops. It does. Let's grab it now. Let's grab the, um, the men-at-arms. Oh, next month they'll want a white piece? Yep. Alright. Now we'll be able to declare war while we have the upper hand. We'll be able to get the jump on Denmark, basically. Um, because they won't have their coalition buddies help. Hopefully Poland's AI will be less broken next time. I kind of want Muscovy to declare on us right now. Because then Sweden wouldn't join, and we would have Poland and Lithuania backing us up, and as long as they weren't stupid with their troops, um, we'd be able to wreck them. Wreck, 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 wreck them. So how's Scotland looking? They still have a guarantee on France? Or they are still guaranteed by France? Big difference there. <laughs> Our heavies and galleys are done. Wait, they attacked you without gaining anything. Yep, we white pieced. I, um. Due to the Hansa sieging up some provinces over here, um, they were able. We were able to get positive war score. So. We're fine. 
Let's drop that Statesman Advisor, because we're not really able to afford him. Even though he's only a level 1. But now he has 7 troops, 4, four Carracks, and 3 Galleys, okay. Let's gain the Mercantilism. We can grab another Diplotech, so we may as well. We'll wait, though. Yep. Waiting. Oh, um, Halogaland? That's one of the ones up here. Hmm. Maybe it's worth it? This is until pretty much the end of the game. And it is a mountain province, so it has a reduced supply limit. And also severe winter. You know what? It'd be worth it in the long run. To have defensiveness as high as possible there. Maybe defensive ideas would be a decent one. It does give... Um, defensive gives morale and army tradition. Both of which we would really need. Gives maneuver, which is even more important nowadays. And... Fort defense, which is great because, well, we do have tons of winter provinces. And it reduces our attrition, which is great because we have tons of winter provinces. Yeah, it increases tradition or attrition completely. You know what? Defensive seems great. Let's wait on that, though. We have lazy diplomats, so let's um, improve relations with some people. Denmark may as well be one of those people. We were at war, so they don't even have the, uh, the improved relations anymore. At least that's what it seems like is the reason. They're going to full an X-ray zone. Right. We need to do something. This looks so tempting. If it wasn't for France, this would be really tempting. Is allied with England. Tuscany's in the Empire. Byzantium's getting eaten alive. Hmm. Georgia? Is a vassal of Karaki on them. But Circassia's just fine. We may just expand to there. We're going to need some, um some stuff for that. We're going to need some bark, or transports for that. Unless we can get access. Yeah, if we improve relations with, um, with Lithuania, we should be able to just get access. So, let's do that. We'll also improve relations, relations with uh, Crimea. This is going to be a no CB war after all, so. Improved relations is needed at least a little bit. And Poland's our ally, so we have access to them pretty much no matter what. Oh, they're actually friendly now, okay. They were not before. You know what? Because you're friendly, how would you like to declare war on Crimea? Well, actually, that wouldn't be nice because they're allied to the Ottomans. We could start beating down on the Ottomans now, though. Oh! Oh, Crimea's a vassal. Hmm. Well, with our Polish alliance, if we declare one Akkion, though, 
it would only be the Golden Horde? Hmm. We need to build our power base somewhere, so... Maybe Circassia seems like a decent idea. Let's, um... Let's get our troops over there. Build three? Or two cogs? Is that like an afford? Hmm. <laughs> Right. Riga is allied to Poland. Livonian Order, allied to Sweden. Novgorod has not claimed any of the Livonian provinces either. Poland would help in that war though. But nah. That would be attacking Sweden, which would be a death sentence right now. Which is why we need to get stronger somehow. I'm confident that with our with uh, Poland as an ally, we'll be able to win any war that's declared on us. As Poland unless it's France or something. But any war concerning Russia will be able to win and other than that at some point we should be able to out navy everybody once we get some money right well Circassia nice knowing ya Poland's going to join the war Poland's going to join the war we don't even need military access through Lithuania only Crimea. Well, let's ask for it now. Crimea denied? Oh, darn you, Crimea. Let's stop improving relations with Lithuania. And we'll resend that guy. Alright. Theodoro is also an independent nation, but let's not worry about them. We're going to take Mantegra and vassalize Circassia in this war. And then from there, they do not have any claims. Hmm. Hopefully they fabricate some claims, though. I'm not really too concerned. Okay, ask for military access. Yep. Let's get some troops ready. declare war on Circassia. Poland will join, so we'll have the Lithuanian and Moldavian troops assisting. I don't know if they're going to get access through, Crimean, through the Crimea, though. Let's do it. Okay. We have some aggressive expansion over here now. Not too big of a deal. Oh? Oh. Well, at least we get a god tier general now. Um, let's ask for some access. Poland won't want their alliance back, but, um. Wow. Traitorous scum. Let's get some, uh. Let's get some troops back over. Ask Poland for some more access, I guess. Jeez, that, that tooltip's not supposed to lie anymore. Eh, they fixed it about five times. Whatever. Okay, uh, Lithuania access. And from here, start the march. They have 7,000 troops. Whatever. Let's uh, build up some troops, and we have access all the way over there, so we'll start walking then, shall we? Anyway, guys, this has been an especially long episode, so 
I'm going to call it here. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Right. Now I stopped recording. Oops. Mm-hmm. <laughs>